Greetings and salutations, welcome to episode 90 of the Bolton Save, and we've just drawn the Champions League group, and um, it's tricky, let's call it tricky, shall we? We have Bayern Munich, Atletico Madrid and Galatasaray in our group, fuck me sideways, that is a horrible, horrible group. I meant to draw the group, but then I hit continue just before the I started recording. Oh man, that is bad. That is really, really bad. Okay, doesn't matter. We're, we're winning the Premiership this year anyway. So Bolton handed a tough group. Yes, thanks for that. Thanks for that. So we have. I have played one game since you were last with us. That was the Reading game. Um, not very good, really. Lewis Cook scoring the winner, one nil. A win's a win, and all that, especially early season. Uh, but we dominated the game a bit. Uh, against the sort of poor Reading side. A little bit disappointing, but two wins out of two. That's the main thing. If we look at the league, there's five uh, five teams with two out of two. All the sort of usual people, really. Chelsea, Man United, Man City, Liverpool. Only Arsenal, Tottenham of the sort of big teams have, have uh, dropped any points so far. Obviously, we're, I'm watching Chelsea. We're after Chelsea this season. That is our goal. So today, we are playing the mighty Southampton and also the the... I can't remember... The mighty West Ham in a double. And then we're playing Bayern and Arsenal. So it's going to be two interesting episodes coming up. Right. Um, what is your media? Oh, what do I say to this? What do we reckon of the draw? I think it's a challenging in places, but that's why we're all here. We want to test ourselves against top quality opposition. Oh, we've got Man City in the League Cup as well. Brilliant. <sighs> yeah, let's just concentrate, yeah? Um, we're not going to... Uh, yeah, we're not making any more signings. Um, is that an assessment you agree with, that it's it's been tough? I think it favour us, favours us in many ways, and overall I'm encouraged. <laughs> Makes no sense. Um, I'm only concerned about whether Bolton can win it. Either elsewhere, Chelsea have been drawn against. I don't care about Chelsea. I think they're one of the weaker teams in that group, and they could struggle to make it out of it. Boom! Mic drop. That didn't have any sound effects. Um, uh, just yeah. Oh Jesus Christ! What sort of fix is this? Uh, in light of Burma's when a, a mission of interest. Oh no! Not for sale. Um, yeah, um, yep, yeah, that's good. Oh, Jesus, this is the longest fucking press conference in the world. How are things be? Good. Do you want to ask what I have for dinner? Right, done. Right, press conference, done. That was a bizarrely long press conference. Where's my assistant? Transfer talk, bloody, bloody, blah. blah, blah. I'm glad uh, I had a few comments about the signings and stuff like that. A few people have taken a good look at the Greek and seen that he is going to be a superstar player, I think, for us. Just need to get him in the game, get him involved in the game. Oh, Southampton, they've had a poor start to the season, maybe picked up a point. Come on, boys. Yeah, episode 90, so we're not far off 100. 10 more, and we've hit the 100. That's like two series that have hit 100 episodes this season. That is pretty good. And I'm, I'm hoping we've got, because I did the catch-up episode and that transfer episode, I'm hoping we've got some new viewers that haven't quite had a chance to watch all the other 88 episodes and um, have just sort of come on late to us. That's fine. Welcome if you're new. This is our team. It's beautiful. Apart from our goalkeeper who's got... Oh, he's hurt his cock. He's got a cock injury. Mm. Right, so good. We've got Fraser Forster. Decent, experienced backup goalkeeper. Perfect backup goalkeeper in my eyes. The rest of the team are going to go with the same team again. We're going to... Oh, no, we're not. I'm lying. Leper's coming back. So we're going to play Leper on the bench and Rivas... Um, he's still learning English, so we're just going to let him uh, let's play a few games in the reserves with the kiddies and see how we go. Right. I need the Afro. If the Afro doesn't score this game, I'm going to drop him for Xavi, okay? I'll make that uh, part of my team talk. Mate, if you don't score, you're fucking out. All right, you slag. Here we go. Shows lack of class. 
Um, yeah, it's, it's incentive. Right, so that means, can we go for a revenge? Um, yes, there it is. The revenge option. All right, we're going to smash them. They've had a poor start. We're at home. Watch as the magic is presented to you in a style of a football game. You're just going to sit back in wonderment at how good our team is. Any minute now. Any second. If you can hear banging, that means the work is still going on outside. It's never fucking ending, this building work. Okay. Any second, the magic, people. You're going to see the magic. Watch this counter-attack. Watch this counter-attack. Just fucking clear it. Okay, there it goes. Here it goes. The afro. Da -da 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 -da. Go on, the afro. Here he goes. Look at him. Look at the pace, the power. The big black salmon. Ball inside to the Greek. Back to the afro. Can he find a ball in? Not really known for his crossing. Emre Chan. Oh, he's the bloody pass back. That was nice though, we did actually get the counter attack, which I was quite surprised by. <laughs> Defro coming deep to get the ball. He's on a complete forward support, so he does drop deep to get balls, um, support that midfield when necessary. Cookie. The Afro, can he turn? He does, plays it out to Chambers. The assist king into the Greek. Oh, it's a good block from Badal. Corner ball, Azui. Back on to the back post. Manalas is going to get there. Just give it simple. Give it simple, Manalas. Nice. Cheeky. Oh, I hate that when the highlight ends like that. <laughs> okay, so bright start, but we've not really penetrated them good and proper yet. Can we nick one before half time? It's the Greek on the ball. Can he beat his man? Beat his man. He's done it. The Af oh my god, that's a sitter, Afro. That is an absolute sitter. Oh dear. Oh, we're not going to get the afro from, like, the season before last, are we? Like, two goals in 25. <sighs> well, you've got 15 more minutes, afro. Otherwise, oh, you're being substituted and replaced next game. Simple as that. No. No, I say a good interception. Can he start the counter-attack? Here we go, Azui. He's been quiet so far this season. Good ball for the Afro. This is it. This is your chance. Yes! Get in the air. That's what we needed. Oh, he's gone for the... He's got rid of the Afro again. He's going for the straight up, like, vanilla ice haircut. Nice. He had to score it. He knew he had to score it. And he plants it. Left peg as well. Well done, the fro. Deserved breakthrough for the mighty whites. Right, half an hour left. Greedish has gone off for Will Aldon, the ex Newcastle. No, right, Garrett. Good young goalkeeper, Garrett is. Badal. Carlos Gil. Gil. Is that his name? Gil. Gil. Oh, that's a dreadful pass. What is that? Azui's pounced on it. Can he find a ball? Can he find a ball? He has found a ball to Aya. Hit one. Oh, good save. The Greek. Oh, what a double save. I shouldn't have. I said the goalkeeper was good. I shouldn't have said it. All right. We're going to go for Azui. And... Um, give Leper a little bit of game time just to get his match sharpness up. Free kick, floated over. Oh my lord, Chambers. Wrong, it fell to the wrong person. He's not really known for his goal scoring exploits, old Chambers. We should have scored. This is this is worrying me a little bit that our lack of composure and finishing. We're creating the chances, just not. But four clear cut chances and four half chances, and we've scored one goal. I'm hoping it's just early season, you know, bedding in new players and all that sort of stuff. But the afro's off the mark. That's the main thing. Right, don't concede a silly goal now. It, I feel like if we're on top at this sort of stage, I don't feel the need to go like, oh, really defensive, bloody blah, blah. 
I think keep the pressure on. We're playing well, so continue to do so. Lovely ball out. Thray has got a bit of space. Is he going to hit one? No, he threads it through to Green. The Greek, even. <laughs> Come on, Greek. You've got to do better with your finishing, buddy. Right. Is that going to be it? I think five. Look, ten decent chances we've had. <laughs> That's not good. Their goalkeeper, I think, might win man of the match. Manalas does well. The back line's not been threatened at all this game. Emre Chan, good ball forward to the Afro. Plays it out to this right-hand side. The Greek picks it up. Plays it back to Chambers. Fires a ball in. Air with Victor and it's offside. Right, that should be enough to see it out. No, we're going to have just a super-duper long highlight for no apparent reason. Oh, oh, oh. What's his name? Dildick. Okay. Trezeguet. Dildick's chasing it. Chambers does does the dirty work. Just gets it at, into touch. All right, if we can clear this away, we should be golden. Away! 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 Don't. Don't. No. Oh, Jesus, don't dive in. There we go. About as comfortable as a 1-0 as you can get. We should have scored at least three, four goals there. But we won. We're three for three. We're marching. We're chasing fucking Chelsea. Come here, you little bitches, Chelsea. We're coming for you. And Chambers impresses. Lots of scouting updates. I've got my scouts sent all across the world again for the next year. Right. We've got 12 days. I did a, a little video. Um... I'm not sure if this will be up before or after, but if not, then either I did a little video, I'm about to do a little video talking about the England game and also some fun stuff that happened on my channel, and it's going to be kind of a little sort of chat each couple of weeks or something, or whenever I've got something to say really, so I'd appreciate it if you guys check it out and let me know if you enjoyed it or not, or if it's just something I should just shut up about and not not make it it's just a fun little 10 minute video where i talk talk about some funny stuff that happened in england and all that stuff don't want transfer dead dying day so go check it out i was going to sort of talk about it in here but i thought no because it's like non-football manager we'll stick to the football manager a little bit more and obviously like building work in the garden that's an important subject we always have to talk about because then motherfuckers won't ever stop i think they're almost done they're just currently building a fence, which is great. Great. <sighs> so we just sort of sit here then in awkward silence, shall we? Boop, 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 boop. I've got nothing to talk about now. What the fuck? Two all with Bolivia? Oh, do you know who um, England manager is in my game? Andre Green scored three. Um, Jose Mourinho is now England manager. I feel like that's going to happen one day. And that's going to be horrible because I really hate Jose Mourinho. Um. Okay, new sponsorship deal. That's nice. Cookie gets player of the month. And Zemko... Oh, the Greek gets second in the young player. It's not really set the world alight so far, Greek. I feel like he's missed a couple of chances that he should have buried. He scored in the first game, so I'm not too, I'm not too worried. Um, but there was a couple of good chances. Yeah, that was Andre Green's first cap, wasn't it? Nice, one cap, one goal. Have it. Um, Oh, and Leper is off the mark for Argentina. 20, 18 caps already at the age of 22. Pretty special. Um, how much did Leper cost me? It wasn't a massive amount. Was it 10.5? What a bargain. Okay, let's have a look. We've got to register players for the next phase. Yeah. What an exciting thing that is. Um, he's homegrown. Uh, yeah. Okay. 
Who we got? West Ham. How have they started the season? Go and raise Arsenal. Shit! Did I? I thought he was under 21 and it went in. Shit! Shit! <laughs> no, he is in the team. I thought he was. I thought he was. I can't do anything now, can I? That's not going well, boys. <clears throat> I thought that it was automatic. Man, I can't do anything, mate. Oops. I'm so used to it, it's weird because I have a, I, I always have a relatively small squad um, when I play football manager. I usually normal normally automatically pick do the registration, let my assistant do it because it's never an issue. But obviously, yeah, that one didn't go well. Um, but I've lost words. Um, um, shit, what do I say? Let's be honest, it was an administrative error. Oh, this is not going to go down well. This is, let's be honest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. What? what? <sighs> I want a transfer to a club with a man. <laughs> Let's rebuild our relationship, man. You know the transfer window's closed yet, Joe? You know, Joe? Yeah? Just, oh, I thought I'd let you know. Don't, don't start getting too arsy, though, because I will turn on you. I'm not afraid to make the big decisions. Um. Oh, this is that's that's gone. That's it's not gone well, boys. I could have. I should have sent my assistant to go deal with. <laughs> like this fucking fault. I'm, I'm confused. I'm confused because I struggle for homegrown players. So even auto registration, why wouldn't they pick the homegrown players? I'm I'm so confused. Oh, that that has proper confused me. That has it doesn't take much to confuse me. Admittedly, it's weird because, like I said, for all of FM sixteen, I've always auto registered my players. Um, scouting updates. Yeah, yeah, nobody cares. Right, West Ham, they've had a pretty poor start to the season as well. 15th spot, so hopefully we can pick up a win here, make it 4 out of 4. The question is now with Joe Gomez, is, is he the sort of player, some players are professional, this is to do with their sort of hidden stats. Some players are professional and will just carry on being doing their best regardless of their happiness some players will be little shitty miserable children I think we'll give him a game and see go on then might as well scout the Champions League right West Ham away um, yes he's dreadful you may have him for as long as you like so now we've got only three teams on maximum points. We've dropped Man United and Liverpool in the maximum points race. It's good. Next episode is going to be fucking horrible. Bayern Munich and Arsenal. Um, although it did say that Atletico were favourites for the group. So maybe Bayern have gone down a little bit. <laughs> Clutching at straws, I think, I feel. Um... Yes, 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 yes. Oh, stop bringing it up. He's already a bit rattled by it. I'm going to give him a go. All right. See how he does. Okay. If he starts banging in own goals, we'll know there's something horribly wrong. 
because if he has one half decent game, we can then go and chat and say, "Well done for your professional stuff," and he'll go, "Oh, thanks." And then we should be able to rebuild his confidence quite quickly. Um, a is down to eighty-eight percent. That's enough to start. I don't really want to start Leper. We'll, we'll bring him on as a sub, I think, and the rest stays the same. The Afro keeps his place due to the fact he scored in the last game. Zach Clough! Dun dun dun! Zach Clough, you traitor! He's been about the block this bit. He's, yeah, he's never really made it. It's been sold for quite a bit of money. Um, now he's playing for West Ham. Okay, fine. Alright, come on, boys. Let's make it four out of four. Continue the march for the Premiership. Lewis Cook with a foul in the first minute. Brilliant. Let them know you're there. Ah, oh, that fucking building work, people. It's never ending. Right, not the most exciting of games, but Joe Gomez hasn't scored a known goal yet, so that's a benefit. Not a single shot. Okay. Right, Zimmer frame with the throw in. It's a long one to Danny Drinkwater, now playing for West Ham. Long ball forward to this right hand side. Guerrero does well. Chan to Cookie to Azui. Tries to get an early ball over the top. Chan gets it back. Aya plays the ball forward to the Greek, but Kufal, Kufal. Oh, oh, that's a good tackle. Got to get it back. Win that, win that. Emre Chan. That's what he's there for, winning those balls. He's a big, big fecker. He can win those long, high balls as well. This is a weirdly long highlight. I don't like it. Oh, how have you lot let Cluffy get to the ball? No, no. No. Oh, what a tackle. Who is that? Who is that? Chambers with a beautiful sliding blocky tackle thing. Ball to the back post. <clears throat> right, come on. Get it away. Easy. Easy clearance. But it's gonna, he's going to get another try. He must be of some age now, and he drink water. He's not the youngest chap in real life now. He's got to be well into his 30s. He must have a long bomb throw. He does indeed. Cluffy picks it up. Floats one back in. Should be easy for the goalkeeper. Nice one, Forster. Solid. He's a big fecker and he throws a Forster. Right. We continue with the longest ever highlight. Oh, for fuck's sake. Giving it away. Ricardo Pereira. Oh, no. No. Good save, Forster. Come on, boys, sort yourselves out. Settle down. That's better. That's a better clearance. I'm fed up with clearing a corner and it going always going back to the corner taker. Okay, this is not good, people. This isn't. This is not good. Oh no, Clough, don't do it. Don't do it, Clough. Oh, Gomez with a tackle. Well done, Gomez. That's good. That's what we wanted to see from you. Oh, Jesus Christ. Settle down. Fucking hell, people. Can we can we chill out? Nice. Nice. Here we go. The Afro. First time we've really seen him on the ball. He's charging at the defence. They're, they're rattled because he's just so skilled. Oh, fucking hell. Never mind. <laughs> Scratch that. I was going to say skillful. Okay, hmm, interesting half of football. <clears throat> interesting, interesting. I'm going to try something in the second half. We're going to go for Grinibun, he's going to come on, but then we're going to swap them over. The Greek is not trained for the left side, but... Obviously, being predominantly right-footed, I want to see if he can do do decent there because we can always retrain him if need be. He's only a youngster. Chambers and Ayer are quite tired. We'll sub them off shortly. Right? Can we have a decent highlight for us, please? That'd be nice. Emre Chan, short ball to Ayer. Oh, that is awful! Awful passing. <laughs> Gomez, please don't, please don't, Gomez. That's it. So it looks like Gomez is pretty professional. He's just going to get on with it regardless. 
What the fuck is that? What was that? Is that... Zimmer frame's been sent off for some weird, bizarre, glitchy tackle. But we'll take it, and we're going to go instantly attacking, see if we can hit a goal early. Who's our free kick taker? I've got no idea. It looks like a left footer. It's Gribben. On as a sub. Hmm. You know Payet, are you? Right, we need to get Leper on for air. And then we'll put, oh, both our fullbacks are getting a bit tired as well. Come on, let's get a goal, boys. Come on. We're going to go for, eventually going to go for a assertive push forward. Come on. We want this 100% record. West Ham goal kick. Manalas does well, plays it along. The Greek. Uh, well, who's that to, yeah? Like, the Invisible Man. Deck clears it. Come on. Can we attack from this? Guerrero. Cookie to the Greek. Plays it into the Afro. Turn. Come on. Come on. Do something useful. That'll do. Lovely ball to the edge of the area. Emre Chan. Fire one. Hit one. Hit one for the love of God. Shoot. Oh my God. Why didn't you pass? <clears throat> and why did the goalkeeper save a shot that was going five yards wide? Uh, Emre Chan, mate. You've got to sort your shooting out. That's two in the last two games that have been fucking woeful. Right, Xavi's coming on. We're going overload. Fuck it. Overload's shit, though, isn't it? Yep, yep, overload is shit. Overload is just shit. It does nothing. Oh, we've, got, we've dropped points. 30 seconds, go, go. Savvy, get a ball in. Chambers, get a ball in. Decent. No, no, that's it. It's all over. Nil, nil, ball draw. Gomez has done well, though. That's it. Nice tackle. See it out, see it out. Just let it go. Let it go, let it go. <coughs> Forster stepped in and done really well. I'm very happy with that. Shows what sort of solid backup goalkeeper he is. Lewis Cook's demotivated. It was a disappointing performance, man. Okay, Chelsea also... Oh, they lost. So did Man City. Right, good. All in all, good. I still refuse to believe that Joe Gomez isn't in the squad. Okay, I just refuse to believe that he's not in the Champions League squad. It makes no sense as to why my assistant would do that. I know I'm like blaming my assistant, and really I should have just done it my fucking self. Goal of Xavi worries, but he's barely playing, mate. He's playing as a little super sub. Chill, chill the fudge out. We're just going to get to the Bayern game because I'm, I'm still not believing it. Obviously, it's true, but I'm not believing it that Gomez is not in the squad. Okay, but goalkeeper's back, which is nice. Fraser Force has done perfectly fine, though. I just want to see. I just want to see. Next episode, we will be playing Bayern Munich and Arsenal. So it's going to be a massive episode. It's going to show our credentials, really, in both in both competitions. And then after that, we've got Bloody Man City. So fun times, I guess. Can't believe he's not registered. That's weird. Weird. Okay, my own fault. No, nobody to blame but myself. I shouldn't have been lazy. Thank you very much for joining me, guys. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hit that like button if you did, and subscribe if you're new and all that stuff. And I will see you bright and early in the next one. Bye-bye.